UFC 내에서 한 가지만으로 사람이 힘든 걸 알, 알고 뭐 스탠딩에 집중을 많이 했고 또 지고 나서 훈련을 두 배로 더 열심히 집중했던 것 같습니다. Uh, he knew that he couldn't survive with just one, you know, one style of fighting, so he concentrated on standing and he trained twice as much as before, and that's why he did. Kim, what did you want to say uh, after the fight that you didn't get a chance to? 아까 우리 형님 이거는 꼭 트랜스레이 하라고 막 얘기하는 거잖아. 어. 한국 쪽은 나라지만 어. 어, 그거 뭐라고 했나 뭐 이런 거. 어, <웃음> 어, 대한민국이라면 정말. 작은 나라지만 작지만 강한 나라라고 생각하고 한국에는 전사의 심장을 가지고 있는 그런 강한 선수가 굉장히 많고 나보다도 강한 선수가 많, 많기 때문에 그런 찬스가 없으니까 그 유입축에서 우리나라에 관심을 많이 가져서 그 동안 한국 선수들이 유입축 오면 잘할 수 있다고 내가 자신할 수 있으니까 그 얘기를 했습니다. Uh, he basically said that um, South Korea is a small country, but we're also a strong country. You know, we have a lot of strong fighters and um, uh, there are a lot of fighters who are skilled but doesn't have chance to they, who, but doesn't don't have chance to fight in UFC. But he wishes that he can he can almost guarantee that if they come to UFC and, and they can perform for you know, fans. That's what I have to say. Do any do any immediate names come to mind when thinking of fighters that can come over to the UFC from South Korea and uh, uh, do good performances? Uh, Bay, who's a champion in LFC in Macau, uh, who's also a teammate, he's part of Team, uh, team Mad, and uh, Du Ho Choi, and he fights in Japan, featherweight, uh, he's a pretty well known fighter. Uh, he was, du Ho Choi was uh, supposed to fight uh, uh, for the champions, uh, champion belt in Japan, but he almost beat like everybody in Japan. Thank <laughs> you.